Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is part two of nudging your nodes or your handles. So we're going to go up to a range and convert this to a curve. We're going to take our shape tool and select them all. I'm going to right click and convert them to curves. Now I've got my, this is a 10 inch rect or a 10 inch square. I've got my nudge factor set on two, like I did in the previous video. I'm going to move this one up, move that handle up. I'm going to select this. I'm going to move it up, move this one up, move this one to the left, move this one to the left, click on this one, move it to the left, and move this to the left. That's a pretty cool shape if you were going to do something like this. Control D and make a duplicate of that. Grab that node right there and put it right there. This would be like a mosaic or a tessellation that you could keep going on forever. Pretty cool. Let's color them in different colors. Let's go with uh, blue. Blue. Click on that one, make it purple. Click on that one, make it turquoise and make that one orange. Pretty cool effect. Anyway, a little bit of fun. You can use that for a lot of projects. Uh, this would look really cool in wood, cut out, and do like a tessellation. Hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.